Hello and welcome to maybe one of the most important videos that I've actually made on this channel and it's going to be talking about the importance of patience in trading. I think a lot of people lose money in trading because they become impatient. They start to take a trade when they haven't got that set up. E.g. they start to gamble and not be patient waiting for the high technical levels of confluence which is a must needed skill of a trader. The patience to wait for the level that we have spent hours achieving or working out via technical analysis to lose the patience, take a trade before it happens, and then lose money. Lose patience, lose money. Stay patient, make profits. That's the CC pool way. That's what I'm going to be emphasizing in this quick video for you. Actually, kind of funny, if you are a contender or champion, I've literally just got out of the live stream five minutes ago. And oh yes, I have done a quick wardrobe change. So for those contenders and champions watching, I'm back five minutes later, literally just got out of that live stream. I'm going to talk about something on this public video as we talked about there. And it was uh, something very simple. Okay, we'd obviously been going sideways for the whole of today. And I made a very important um, topic. Of course, I wasn't worried about this Bitcoin drop. Still bullish, still looking for higher prices, still looking for those long opportunities, right? And for me, uh, I'm going to explain a level that we've just bounced off of. And how I come about this earlier in the day, very from the very moment I woke up, posting it in my group, making them aware of this, and then what's happened here... I'm going to be explaining that in this segment on the video, and then we can move on. Uh, and for me, uh, it was simple, right? I had, first thing in the morning, I had given this daily level below us, which was at 22,830. So I posted that in my group as I woke up this morning. Then around 7 p.m. this evening, I reminded my team of the levels that I was waiting for. Of course, that daily that I gave in the morning hadn't been hit yet. So for me, I had taken zero trades on Bitcoin. Rigi, I'm remaining, I'm remaining patient for one of my levels to be hit. And the level for me was either 24K or it was the lower daily level. Okay, so I wanted to wait for one of these levels to be hit before I take a trade. The daily level that I was referring to for that long was the one below price action for this one at 22 as we zoom in here, $22,832, okay? So we also were very much aware of the Powell speech that was happening at 7.30, and the rate hike come out around um, 7 p.m. I even wrote to my team, uh, this was in general chat, I said to them, you know, this rate hike is not going to be as effective as when Powell starts speaking at, at 7.30, so you've got to be ready and waiting for this, and like clockwork, like clockwork 7.30 came, and we hit the level that we were patient for, and obviously with the most perfect reaction. Just will read you this post that I posted on Twitter, I, I see a lot of people also getting into that long trade with me, so that's, that's good, but I want to just emphasize here, patience paid once again for my team at CC Pool. I gave the levels to trade, the daily was hit, and the instant pump happened from that level. I don't care about the news or what somebody said. All I care about is the technical analysis and the level that gave me that, you know, and the level to get me that trade and make me the money. This is the only way to beat the market. If you are, you know, unpatient, if you are looking for, you know, what's happened on the news, then you have to digest that information and then you've already missed the trade, right? But if you were patient and you had already had marked out the exact level you wanted along from this morning, so this was my print screen from around, you know, 10, 10 a.m., I knew that was the level below me that I wanted along, okay, reminding my team at 7 p.m., that's still the only level that I'm looking for to long, well, then that gets hit and that's the reaction, simply perfection, patience paid off once again, team. Other people are managing to get into that entry with me. But I think I just wanted to really emphasize here, if you're waiting for the news, okay, if you're waiting to hear what they say, is it bullish, is it bearish, is it X, Y, and Z, what does this news mean? You've missed the trade. If you were ready, waiting for that level, expecting the move down to trigger your long entry, well, then you've got the trade, you've made profits. And as I've said to my team, this is an acceptable take profit one on that trade. It's already an over 3% bounce. We have seen this before on some of these news events where we get the instant rise and instant move back down. So absolutely, this is a very acceptable time to take a profit one on that long trade. And, um, you know, I'll just end by, by 
showing these posts and this is I love this gift so much but feels good to be in chart champions and learn from the legend himself Daniel and all the coaches truly amazing opportunity we are literally printing money I must sound like a bot joining chart champions one of was one of the best decisions of my life Berraco changing his life it's just so beautiful the community right now highly positive um, printing money like like it's nothing and yeah it all stems because we have the patience we have the trays you have the captain himself leading the ship showing you the levels to wait for and then well the reaction is is right in front of your eyes pretty pretty nice if I say so to myself right um, but yeah that was ex ex you know explaining the importance of patience and um, I just wanted to show you there with a real life example maybe a little bit excited as we as we brought onto this trade and I'm going to die from my throat. I'm just going to take a quick... <coughs> I'm getting too excited, my friends. Too excited. Um, I'm going to wrap this up before I die. And that is just to say, once again, the importance of patience. If you march out the level, remain patient for it. If you were long too early, you get stopped at. If you short too early, you get stopped at. If you took any trade before our level was hit, you got stopped at and you lost the trade. Remain patient. It's three steps. Do your technical analysis work out the high level of confluence, mark out that level, understand that's the level you want to trade, remain patient for that level to be hit, check the reaction. If we had just went straight through that level, no trade. If we got the reaction, which we did, very nice trade, take the trade, you're banking profits within, you know, just a few minutes. So yeah, that was the quick introduction. That was a quick video. <laughs> I'll end with this gift because it's my favorite. This is my city. These are my people. And I will not abandon them. My favorite gift. I'll probably do a bit of a longer video tomorrow, but I just wanted to pump out this video really quickly just to show you a real example of the importance of patience. So cheers, everybody. Thank you. And uh, remember this important legal disclaimer before I end, I suppose. And that is uh, no financial advice, not a financial advisor. Trades on paper, demo trade accounts, right? Cheers, everybody. And goodbye.